dive into a little bit about the fandom that is Glee. Hey everyone, welcome to what is normally Web Love Wednesdays where I tell you about the people and the places on the web that I am loving, but we are in the smack dab middle of our week of Glee. So today I want to talk about some things that have come out of the internet um, that are pretty, pretty crazy, powerful, insane, funny that I have loved um, from Glee being on. So let's talk about charity because that's one thing that often gets overlooked when you are looking at a large fan base and I have to say the major charity things that have been done because of Glee is we've raised so much money for the Trevor Project through multiple different fundraisers um, for birthdays and things like that so I think that's a great thing that our fandom had done um, and I hope will continue to do after the show ends and then the second is the creation of two kind of separate entities that do vastly different things but at the same time deal with pretty awesome and powerful movements from the fandom. So the first would be the incredible ladies over at the Boxing Project. Now the Boxing Project was started as a way to raise money for charity to get Ryan Murphy to release the boxing from A Extraordinary Merry Christmas. Um, where we had the still of Curtin Blaine with a ring box, but we never got the actual scene until a couple months later when Ryan released it on Twitter, but we had raised a bunch of money so that he would do so. And now it has turned into this massive charity that is incredible and powerful and beautiful. So check out The Boxing Project if you haven't already. And then on the other side of things, there is a wonderful woman uh, named Barb who started Hugs for Chris, which originally was a Twitter campaign um, to kind of help spread love to the Glee cast um, with positivity through Twitter using the hashtag Hugs for Chris. And it has now turned into this massive book drive that she does for Chris Colfer's Land of Stories books, which is really incredible. And they've donated over 2,200 books to children's hospitals, um, which is a lot and you have to think that this is all stemming from one TV show and specifically those three things really stemmed from two power couples, Clayne and Britanna. Now if I'm going to talk about the Clayne fandom, I'm going to talk about e-online polls because even though it's not charity, the Clayne fandom and the Britanna fandom, they worked their butt off. Specifically the Clayne fandom, I don't think there was, with the exception of this most recent poll, a poll that they did not win where it was a favorite TV couple since they started, which shows the power of the internet. Now, the internet at times for Glee could be very funny, it could also be very scary, but I think what's great about it is that we have kind of shaped, in a way, what is traditionally crazy on the internet, but also just insane. And I could not be prouder to be have any small part in the Glee fandom online, because I think we have some of the funniest memes and some of the most brilliant writers and some of the most brilliant graphic designers and there was a freaking like publishing house created out of fandom works from fandom artists that are now becoming published authors with um, adapted novels from these fan fictions and original novels and that's pretty badass if you have to think about it. I mean Twilight had that and look where Fifty Shades of Grey went. Not the greatest example, but it's an example. Um, I think Glee fandom in general online has probably been one of the craziest and funniest things I could have been a part of, specifically in the past about four and a half years is when I've been really intense into fandom, um, including things like Talk At Me As I Eat and Gay Hogwarts and just all of the memes. So I am asking you to tell me your favorite Glee meme in the comment section below if you have one. Um, that's about it for this video. I kind of just wanted to talk about like really cool things that have stemmed online because of fandom. Um, it's pretty powerful what a fandom can do. So yeah, that's about it. Um, tomorrow is kind of a serious note video. Um, there's also going to be another bonus video that's uploaded tomorrow that's not Glee related. Um, but YouTube related, so be on the lookout for that. As always, there's links to my social media in the description bar below. Um, subscribe if you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!